Hey yo, how's it going everyone? My name's Alex and Buffalo and welcome back to Pokemon Unite. We are playing some Blastoise. I have been playing him a lot since he came out and he is insane. <laughs> um, he's great. Freaking amazing if you're looking for someone who's really good and a defender to play. Um, yeah, we're going to be playing him. I've had a lot of success with him. This will be a Ultra. We are an Ultra now, finally. Which has been nice. Um, we got a couple vets on our team and then some Ultra, so it should be a good game. We are going to be running, most likely, the Surf and Hydro Pump build, which is a little bit more of a utility, true defender type style build. It's good. So we will be shooting for that. I am running Score Shield, Focus Sash, and... Um, oh my gosh, I totally forgot its name. Um, score Shield, Focus Sash, and... Oh my gosh, I'm drawing a blank. Anyway, I'll put it up on the I'll put it up on the screen and you can see it. I'm having a major brain fart right now about the other item. Ooh, I think we got that. That's a dead bulbasaur probably. Oh, he's not. Wow. He barely got out of that. That is an insane combo. So early game squirtle is super good. And if you can do that where you skull bash, which does a minor um, stun on him into your water gun to shoot them back. It is a really good way to set up your the other person you're with if you guys think you can kill him, that target. And we almost did. He had to f use his uh, uh, eject button to get out of that. So we almost made a really good play out of that. We hopefully can we'll be able to just get bees really safely here. Um, our talent flame is scoring while bees are up. Um, oh, we might be able to save him here at least. We'll get about if nothing else. Oh, I missed. I missed the skull bash. Unfortunately, went a little deep, but that's all right. We're gonna heal up real quick. Let's grab this. Oh, I did not mean to take the second one. That's my bad, dude. My bad. Did not mean to take that second one. Um, did we not get many of those bees? No, we did. Well, that guy's toast. <laughs> um, I'm gonna go score real quick. We're doing well here. Got the Hydra Pump now. Ooh, I freaking kept him in that. That was awesome. Kept him inside the... Ooh, and I stole that. Even better. Oh, this is going really well top lane right now. Me and Kramer are just bullying the heck out of them. We'll snag one of those. We'll keep leveling here. Level six. We are cruising. We are kind of bullying top lane right now. Is moy moy good oh. Push that guy out of the way. That's a dead Bulbasaur. Now we'll get the bees. Those are the kind of plays you gotta look for with, uh, with when you're Squirtle and Wartortle. You look for those kind of plays. If someone out positions and you can set up a kill, an easy kill for your buddy, you definitely take it. And now we are quite ahead. Um, we're probably gonna be able to, oh, I thought I was gonna be able to take that. Unfortunately, not. Um, we should be able to get this kill. What? I don't know about that one, sir. Oh, that guy's dead now, though. We scored my 27 points. We took top. Unfortunately, um, we did not go straight to Dread. So hopefully our team is okay. If nothing else, they can try to stall it. I am on the way. Um, War Turtle Blastoise is good, really good at protecting Dread for your team, especially if you're doing the Surf Hydro Pump build, because you can pretty much keep any of their danger people off of it entirely. You can just set up some really good plays for your team. Like right there. We surf and then hydro pump, keep them all in there. We do the same thing with that one. And then that's a free dread for our team. And we'll just keep this Blissey out of the way so that she can't screw with them. I'm gonna back off a little bit here. Help team get that. There we go. We are now Blastoise with the insane Blastoise ult. Ooh, that's a bad surf, unfortunately. Keep that guy off me. Um, 
was an okay usage of that. Okay, we need to get out. We need to be out yesterday. Unfortunately, we're dead. Is only me and the Greninja? I'm not... The bees must have come up or something. Wigglytuff and Alolan Ninetales were not supporting us at all, unfortunately. Otherwise, that would have been quite a few kills. Most likely, Cramorant did get Rotom top as well. So that is actually really, really good. Got Rotom and Dreadnought in the same go. We didn't even need our guy. It was a f probably a 5e. I don't know if there was five of them bought, but he got it. So we are cooking with gas. This match is going well. As long as we don't do something silly like a... Oh, hello, Greninja. I see you. I see you, buddy. We can play that game if you would like. We'll bring the bees over to me where I can get them more safely. And then we'll keep autoing them. Uh, Greninja did leave, it looks like, which is interesting. Bring this guy back. When you are doing this build, you don't do a ton of damage. It's kind of hard to get some of this farm. But that's okay, it's not necessarily your job. It's just things like Vespa Queens are a little, can be a little tough to deal with. But that's not that big of a deal. Um, we probably are gonna go see if we can make a big play down bot real quick. Eh, they got that. Dreadnought is coming up, so we do want to be in position to help with that. I am looking for this big play here. Is our ult? Get that big stun, knock up, take out a bunch of them there. Um, unfortunately, we are kind of solo right now. All of our team died. I am the only one up, which is not very good. I'll have to use Surf to get out of there. Uh, that's a dead Machamp, probably. Oh, okay. Interesting. I missed that. You should be able to get that, though. Use this to help our boy. There we go. Got him out. That is a... Oh, okay. Our team should be able to get here, though. Yeah, our team's here. So that should be ours. Their Greninja is top. We did dunk some points, but if we can get Dreadnought, that's well worth Nice, 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 nice. Yeah, so that's that should be an easy dreadnought for them. So I'm gonna go top and make sure this guy doesn't get Rotom, which he's not starting. In case you did not know, you can look at the Pokemon with your map. So you hold your left bumper and then move that. You can see if they're taking damage or not. <laughs> um, I don't know if that's intended. It must be because they haven't done anything with it. It's kind of it's a good way to see if the team's actually doing anything though on those points. Really, really handy. Oh my gosh, I want this. I want those four extra score. And I didn't even get him. That guy got him. <laughs> That's okay. We just the tanky boy. We just a tanky boy. Um, I don't necessarily... Bot probably needs help, but I can help this guy. That's fine. I should probably tank some of these hits for him. Okay, we got Rotom, so at least they can't use that against us. Um, I will probably push with it. They're doing pretty well bought, so I will stick with the Rotom here. Do this. Oh, I wasn't able to, unfortunately. I'm gonna score real quick, since that is wide open. Ooh, that much champ is doing some damage here. I am probably just gonna get out. That is fine. We disrupted him. Let's see if I can steal this real quick. Get us a little bit further ahead. We're going to jump in here. I'm going to back to get some health, and then I will be heading mid to help guard that. Shoot back in. Oh, we don't want to attack Zapdos. We just need to guard it. We are definitely winning right now. Ooh, we surfing in here. Deal with these boys, they're all dead. That was a really bad fight on them. They walked into us, which is exactly what we wanted. And now I can basically puppy guard this from here. And then I just don't let him do what he wants to. I do want to take that. There we go. And that's definitely a win for us. Use that to try to keep our boy alive. Now we just trying to score. Oh, he's got that one. 
Hop over here. Do the old dunky dunk action. Block that. Now I'm going to go back and defend. So now we just defend. Try not to try to let them score as few points as possible. Ninja's going to score there. There's nothing I can really do about that. And I'll just sit here and guard this point. Keep him off of this. And then, yep, Nine Tails is perfect. That's exactly what you want to do. You want one person on each thing and then one person as backup that can shoot to the point that's needed. So as long as they don't let anybody score up there, that should be easy victory. Let's go. Hopefully. They did score some points at the end. Yeah, definitely not enough. I think our whole team was able to score off that, so that was mm, freaking amazing. And that is pretty much what you do with Blastoise. You just disrupt the enemy team as much as possible. You do decent damage. The ult is insane. Really, Blastoise's entire kit is insane. And that's the Surf Hydro Pump build, which is my favorite, probably, just because you do get all that crowd control, CC. Um, the other build, though, the Rapid Spin Water Spout build is also really good. It just does a ton of damage, and you can't be stopped while you're doing it, so you just get to do whatever you want, basically. We almost get MVP. All of our team did great, honestly. I'm going to go ahead and like all those guys once we're done here, but that was great. Scored 186, 6 kills, 7 assists. That's pretty, pretty good, pretty good. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like down below. Leave a comment. Let me know what you think. Subscribe so you can catch the next video from me. And otherwise, until next time, I'll see you guys in the next one. See ya.